In this video tutorial, we're going to show you how to set up your profile correctly. The area we're going to focus on for the setup is the first of the 3D issue tabs shown on screen called the Content tab. Let me just explain the template and profile fields you see on screen. A template represents a branding template for your publications. This controls the corporate logo presented to your end readers for the publication and also the separation of the publications within any of the apps. Many of you will only have one template representing your own company brand, but others, such as graphics agencies, may be using our software to deliver digital publications to several different clients. In that case, they would need a different branding template for each client. This will allow each individual corporate branding and also to enable appropriate separation of the publications when they are shown in the apps to the client's readers. Within one template, you can have various different profiles. Several different publications or issues can be published under the same branding template, but each publication may be of a different nature, and therefore you may need to use a different profile with each magazine to allow for different SEO profiles. Ensuring publications are found by the right online audience. Click on the Setup button shown on screen. The first area presented to you allows you to give your branding template a more meaningful name and also a copyright section. We have provided some default text for you, but please feel free to modify if you need to. You can also use the link provided on the screen to link out to a copyright section which you may have available on yours or your client's website. The logo and text section allows us to start defining some of the company branding. We can either present the company logo in the background as the reader is browsing through our publication or provide some text for them instead. Next section, called the domain section, is where you must register the details of the domain or multiple domains where you would like your digital publications to be hosted. You will also be prompted to add in your Google Analytics ID to ensure the publications are found and read by the right audience. You may come back and add new server details anytime in the future. Finally, we have the SEO area, Search Engine Optimization. In this area, you will have more detail for the title, description and keywords for the publication. This is also the area where you can add a new SEO profile and give it a suitable name. Click finish on the screen and this completes your profile setup. And that completes this demonstration on how to set up your templates in the 3D issue software. 